Hi, Dave here again with another quick video on typing and editing text in iOS using VoiceOver. So I've opened a new note here, so I'll turn on VoiceOver and start typing. VoiceOver on. Notes. New note. Note. Text field. Is editing. Capital T. Capital H. H. E. E. Space. Q. Q. Y. U. U. J. I. I. C. C. J. J. And you'll have heard a sound there, which is because I put a J instead of the K by mistake, and that is iOS letting me know that it's offering me an auto correction. So if I hit the space, it'll fix that word. Space, space, quick. B, B, D, F, R, R, I, O, O, W, W, B, N, N, space, F, F, O, O, X, X, space, J, J, U, U, M, M, P, P, X, X, space, space, jumps. O. O C V V E E D F R R space T T H H E E space L L A A X Z Z Y Y space D D O O G G more period period return new line and there we have us empty line to the note text field is editing the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Now, if we want to move to the beginning or the end of the text, we can simply do a double tap, and that will toggle us between the start and end. So, if I double tap, insertion point at start. Here we go, double tap. Insertion point at end. And double tap again. Insertion point at start. And we're back to the start. And we can navigate the text as well by character, by word, or by line. So we use the rotor gesture for that. So we place two fingers on the screen, and do a turn to either clockwise or anti-clockwise to cycle through our rotor options. Words. Characters. So there's characters and now we swipe up or down to navigate through the text by character. So if I swipe up I'll hear that sound because we're at the start of the text. Swipe down. Capital T. And we go T. Tango, H, e, space, Q, U, I, C, K. And voiceover Kilo. will announce each character as it passes it. So I now know that the cursor is to the right of the K because it just said K last. If I go the other direction K, C, I, U, Q. I know that the cursor Cut is to the left of the letter Q. You can also navigate by word by going to the rotor and go to words. Words, quick, brown, fox. And again I know the cursor is to the right of the word fox now so if I go to the delete key Delete, X, delete, O, delete, F. And we've deleted the word fox so I'll put that back G. in. F, F, O, O, C, X, X, jumps, over, the, lazy, dog period. And we also have lines. Lines, lazy dog period, the quick brown fox jumps over the, the quick brown fox jumps over, the lazy dog period. And see, we can navigate by line. The other thing we use the rotor for is to go to the edit menu. So we'll go through the rotor. Words, characters, language, typing, up, edit. And there's edit, and this is where we can do things like bold and underline, and cut, copy and paste and so on and select some text as well. We can select individual words or select the whole text using this menu. So now we're in the edit menu again we can cycle through those options by swiping up or swiping down. Paste. Select all. Italic. Bold. Underline. Select. Paste. Select all. And there is all your options. So if you hit select it'll select whatever word you're currently on. If you hit select all It'll select the whole text, so we'll do that. So it said select all, so now we double tap. Select all. And all the text is selected. Now, if we want to do something with that selected text, we're still in our edit menu, so again, we do an up or a down swipe to go through our options. Italic, bold, underline, copy. So I just say we want to copy that to our clipboard. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Copied. And that's now copied. So, so we exit that note now. Notes. Back button. Notes. And Note. start a new add. one. Button. So we hit add. Note. Text field. And now we're in a new note. And I'll go to the rotor and make sure we go to the edit menu again. Typing mode. Edit. Okay, so we're in edit and I will find paste. Italic. Bold. Underline. Paste. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Paste. And we've created that note by pasting from the clipboard. And that's how we edit text in iOS using voiceover. Thanks for watching.